in George, a group of fed up rugby supporters, supported by the Independent Civics Organization of South Africa, protested to show their disgust at how black players are being treated. Springbok coach Heineka Mayer was called an isolator and black talent killer. They wanted to set a Springbok jersey alight, but were prevented from doing so. Instead, a petition was handed over to the South African Rugby Union's Francois Davids. We are unhappy what's happening in transformation in our country after 20 years. Uh, we still know where we're going to. Our rugby players is in the dark and, and we said it's time for us to stand up. I will deal with it with the, with the president, Mr. Hoskins, and with the full executive uh, council. And from there we will, we will we'll see what we can do about it. Transformation or the lack thereof in rugby is an ongoing debate. Mayor gave his critics ammunition to use against him following Saturday's game against Argentina in Durban. He only had two black players in the starting lineup and played Jesse Creel out of position on the wing with Loazim Vovo, a specialist, on the bench. The best team in South Africa in the Super 15 was the most mixed team, which was the Stormers team. The best form players from many positions were black players. So we need to make sure that we bring the good and black players together in a Springbok team that the whole of South Africa can get, can, can get behind and Saru doesn't seem committed to doing that and that's why we're getting involved and we're demanding that we need a team that reflects our entire country. Kosatu was reportedly approached by five disgruntled Springboks who were seeking guidance. They could have approached the mother body or the Rugby Players Association but there's clearly no trust in these structures. For any player, I mean, a typical example, uh, Elton Janjis, his part there is the form fly off in the Super Rugby. He does not even get a run up until this far. So surely he'll be frustrated, you know. And uh, I think some of the players, they do not have anywhere to go to. And the public is frustrated at the pace of transformation. I think a transformation is very, very key. So let's feel that our black players, so long as they are able to do the work, rather than playing people in the wrong position. When it comes to rugby, I think you got to pick every single player on their merit, not based on any colour. I don't think that team selection is quite fair because it's predominantly Afrikaner, predominantly white. To be honest, um, if you deserve to be there, you deserve to be there. Like, no matter your colour, black, white, Indian, whatever. The Springboks have now lost four test matches in a row, dropping to a low fifth on the world rankings, and that's just ahead of the World Cup. Sfiso Ramara, SABC News, Johannesburg.